David, it is commonly accepted that there are in fundamental physics the existence of other dimensions on a very, very small compactified level. But some cosmologists now are talking about large extra dimensions in parallel with our own and constructing cosmological theories based upon these. Uh, do you think there's a, a reality in that? Well, I'm not even, I mean, it's interesting you say it's commonly accepted <laughs> that, that there are extra dimensions. This is one of the surprising uh, th things that came out of string theory, even though the idea of extra dimensions has been contemplated before, string theory, dis in string theory it was discovered that we had to have more than the three uh, spatial dimensions that we see around us. Um, and of course, since we don't see them, they have to either be very small <laughs> or, uh, as was discovered more recently in the last decade, uh, there could be large extra dimensions in, in what are called warped geometry. So that, again, um, it's hard for us to see those extra dimensions. Uh, we could, in fact, be totally stuck in the three. The stuff we're made out of could be stuck in the three that are visible. Uh, so these are uh, all possibilities within strength theory and, and uh, in which there are a myriad of many too many possibilities, many too many for us to be very predictive about the consequences of the theory, and therefore they should all be explored. Some of them give rise to very interesting scenarios, um, predictions, or if those scenarios were correct, things that uh, observers should look for. Uh, they give rise to different uh, cosmological scenarios that could be tested. They give rise to objects such as cosmic strings sometimes that could be detected uh, and observed. Mm. Um, they give rise to um, possible models where one might try to calculate phenomena in, in our standard theory of particle physics. So they're all uh, suggestive and fascinating scenarios. Uh, and uh, I certainly you know, I think it's great that people are looking into this or even trying to see the uh, observational consequences. Uh, but 